Earlier in this course, I explained how one of our design goals is learning via repetition. Our goal is to show you the core techniques you'll be using all the time in iOS development to give you plenty of opportunities to practice what you've learned so it really sinks in. This leads me to your current challenge, showing the score. Your challenge is to pause the video and modify Bullseye to show the user's total score in the label at the bottom of the screen. This will be a review of several key things you've learned in the course up to this point. Don't worry if you aren't able to figure it out on your own. The important thing is that you try. By giving it your best shot, when you take a look at the solution later, it will really start to sink in. That's it. Go ahead, pause the video, give it a shot, and stay tuned for the solution. All right, so we want to modify Bullseye here to keep track of the score. And so just the fact that we're saying we need to keep track of something means we need to have a state variable. So we're going to create a state var score, and we're going to set that to zero. This is using type inference because we didn't put 0.0, .0 or anything like that. Um, then this is going to be an int, and we can option click to just verify that. Okay, so we want to increase the score every time the user guesses. So here where the button is pressed, we're going to say update the score. So we're going to say self.score equals self.score plus self.points for current round. This is one of those cases where you do need the self dot because you're inside this button action. And now finally, we want to update the score row to actually show the score rather than the placeholder. So we use string interpolation here, slash two parentheses, and inside there, we're just going to put score. We don't need the self dot here. Okay, that's it. Let's build and run. Okay, so the score starts out at zero. Let me try to get close to 10 here, somewhere like that. So, okay, we got pretty close, we were three away, so we got 97 points this round, and the score updates to 97. And if I guess again, then I get another 97, and it's up to 194. 